Yo, I am what's up? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. You guys have clicked on this video for a very spicy reason. You all want to know about this story time, and I'm gonna give you that spicy story time. Next one million. So before we start setting a little bit of context for you, this was two years ago when I had around 100, 150 thousand followers. So I met this girl when I was on a trip to Delhi. I had gone for a shoot and we were kind of talking on Instagram. And me, I am a boy who doesn't know when a girl is flirting with me. Okay, I am sorry. I don't get hints. I don't understand when you're flirting with me. And if I knew this creator was flirting with me, I would have not met her because I just think that would have been a little weird. So I would have just not met her, or I would have met her in a little different environment than I met her when I went to. <laughs> so me and this creator were kind of talking on WhatsApp for a while, you know, it was kind of like, hey, what's up, what's happening, we used to send voice notes and everything to each other. So before making the story time, I was just randomly going through my WhatsApp chats and I found this creator and I was like, oh my god, I forgot this happened. So I was just going through my old chats with her and I saw that she had used a lot of emojis and a lot of different signals which now I am a little better at realizing when a girl is flirting. Back then, bro, 2-3 years ago, I had absolutely no idea when a girl is flirting with me, I used to be like, ah, uh, nice joke or some rubbish thing that I used to write. I didn't understand when the girl's flirting, but now two, three years down the line, I think I am. I'm not that better, but I kind of know now if a girl is flirting with me depending on the emojis she's using. So before I actually went to Delhi, we were talking on WhatsApp that hey, if you ever come to Delhi, meet me, she was saying, and I was like, okay, cool, I'll meet you. What I did notice was there were a lot of this emoji, this kissy emoji being used, which I thought was kind of like, okay, just kind of being friendly, nothing more is gonna happen. And she had used that kind of thing that's like a dot and like a comma and then like a smiley face, like that winky face. I put it up here again for you just to know. Hey guys. So after every message, she used to use one of these two emojis or kind of things in the video and I didn't know what they meant at that time Like I cleared. So I texted her, hey, I might come to Delhi for a shoot because we were planning to meet and she replied by saying, oh my god, if you come to Delhi, please meet me. My friends and I are kind of planning to go out. I'm doing this voice for her, but I mean, this is my girl voice. It's like, oh my god, my friends and I are going out. You should totally join us. And then she said, we can go somewhere alone also after that. That should have been the first signal where I realized that red flag that this is bad news. You should not meet her but hey potato Agastya again I put a picture here no, I was not potato Agastya back then I was not potato Agastya otherwise she would not be talking like that with me <laughs> but yeah she was like we can go somewhere alone also after that and I was like chalo theek hai and you know we kind of spoke that we'll make a collab video or something together so I was like theek hai we can chill and then make a collab video spend some time together I thought she means alone to make a collab video but clearly I realized it's not that after I read our chats so I'm just going to read a couple of chats for you also so you kind of get a better idea of where this is coming from so I text her, hey, I'm coming to Delhi next week. Let's meet for a while and chill. And she's replied with OMG, comma, yes, please, let's meet with this emoji again. Boys and girls, you know what this emoji means. I don't have to explain it further to you, but I didn't know it. And I said, ha ha ha. <laughs> I said, ha 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 ha, okay. Like a O and a K, that's what I said. And then she said what I just told you, yeah, my friends and I are going and let's go somewhere alone. To that, I have responded, ha 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 ha, let's plan something. I kind of got a hint, so I was like, I just want to not give her the wrong message that I'm coming to do something else when I'm just coming to meet another creator and just chill and talk and maybe make a video or even that I'm coming just to make a friend, not to do anything more, not a hookup kind of set. I didn't want to say that word, but now I've said it. So it's very clear, this girl kind of of wanted to hook up but I was not in that zone but yeah let me make this clear this girl is very pretty this girl is pretty I was just not in the hookup stage and I would never hook up with the creator like to this day I decided back when I started content creation that I'm never hooking up with the creator and because of that I was like no cross no hook up with her <laughs> but yeah just to say she was pretty I mean yeah she was pretty anyway and hey who knows I might even reveal this creator's name in the end of the video <laughs> Okay, now the chats are over, I land in Delhi and what happened in Delhi is what I'm going to tell you next. Alright, plane, I land in Delhi and I finished my shoot which was on a Monday I think after reading our chats. It was Monday that my shoot was there and Tuesday that I met her. So I texted her during the shoot because my shoot was going to go on for longer saying that yeah, I might not be able to come out with your friends today because she had told me they're going out to party. I said let's just meet tomorrow. So this is where it gets interesting. After I told her that I might not be able to come out partying with them, she said no worries, you can come to my house late in the night around 1-2am and then you you can crash there only if you want. My parents are not home. So she texted that and I said again. Ha ha. <laughs> I'm so stupid, bro. I don't know when a girl is 
I said, ha ha ha, no worries, the brand has booked a hotel for me, I'm just gonna crash there. Free ka hotel mein na udar jayenge. Haan yaar, free ka hotel mein na mein udar jane wala ho, free ka shampoo hai, mko kuch nahi chura paunga. Tere gharan pe aapko, to tere gharan ke shampoo chura paunga. But yeah, you know, I have a hotel room book, it's very comfy, a king size bed for a little agaste, I'm just gonna sleep there aram se. So I wrapped the shoot and actually ended up meeting another friend in the night, but I didn't tell her this because she would be pissed. So if you are watching this video, I'm sorry. Cheating karta hai to. So the next day in the morning, she calls me at around 9.30, 10.00 saying that, What's up? Where are you? When are we meeting? And this really pissed me off. If there was even a 0.1% chance, which there wasn't, but even if there was of me and this girl doing anything, this is where it died because she disturbed my sleep when I was in this comfy hotel room. AC is on 18. I'm wrapped in their sexy blanket. I'm just chilling on the bed alone, sleeping, having a nice dream. And she's called me in the morning at 9:30. So we spoke. And then 2:30, 3 o'clock. Again, I suggested either she come to the hotel, we can chill in the cafe down. I said in the cafe down. I did not mean in the hotel. Room, but she said, Why down? Let's just meet in the hotel room. And obviously, I was talking to my best friends at that point, sending them screenshots. We all do it fine. <laughs> and this was when they told me that Agaste, you know that this girl wants to do something with you, right? I said, No. They're like, Agaste, you dumbass. I said, Ha, I'm a dumbass. <laughs> but yes, this girl said that she can come up to my hotel room, to which I said, No, cross. So I told her, We'll just meet down in the cafe in the hotel, maybe chill for a little while, and then make a video down on me, and then we dip. She said, No, let me just come up. Up to your hotel room, it will be more cozy and comfy. These are the two adjectives she used in that text. Now I, man, I am scared about posting this video. <laughs> so we ended up meeting in the cafe where she told me where her family is from, where like she's studying and all of that. What made her get into content? And it was a fun, normal conversation. I don't think she dropped any hints there. But right when we were kind of like paying the bill and leaving, she said, "Agastya, you want to come? My house is still empty. My parents are coming back tomorrow. You can stay. Come." And I said. I didn't laugh in person like ha 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 I just said no yaar I have some work I made up some excuse and I got out of it and this is when she said that oh let me just come up to your hotel room for a while we can just chill and I was like bro ye dimag kharab kar rahi hai ladki So she said that the content idea that we can film is something around hotels, and if we are in a hotel room, would be better. I was like, "Chalo, fair point. Let's go to the hotel room, but I will maintain like a six foot distance from our court." Because <laughs> we got up to the hotel room, and like my plan, she was sitting on the bed, I was sitting on the chair, and two, three times she did ask me that, "Come sit here, na, next to me in the bed. Let's think of a content idea." And I think I must have said some dumb excuse. What I can think of right now, no, my back is aching. That's why I want to sit upright and not sleep. And yeah, this girl has gone to sleep. Her legs are on my bed. Inside my blanket. Whoa, 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 whoa. But yeah, then we actually didn't end up making the content because she kind of then got up and came near the chair and was. Thank you so much for watching, guys. <laughs> no, she was kind of like being a little, little too touchy. Hey, 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 hey. Too much for my liking. Like putting her hand around me like this and just chilling, like messing with my hair, and I was like. Ah. And I didn't want to make it awkward for her. Also, I was like, it's fine. It's a fair thing. Creators hook up a lot and tell you this. You guys don't know, but I'm not talking about me. I swear, I'm not hooked up with any creator in my life. You can see this is proof. But Lanti, a lot of creators hook up. I might get in trouble for saying that, but hey, I said it, bro. I don't care. <laughs> but yeah, I didn't want to make it awkward for this girl also because I mean, fair enough. Hormones, puberty, I don't know. <laughs> Temptation. Temptation. If you watch Deepa's Darkest Secret, you know this reference. <laughs> but yeah, I didn't want to make it awkward for this girl, so I was like, okay, ha 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 ha, with my death, bro. So after all this handy business, handy business. After all this hanky panky handy business was trying to happen, like hand on hair, hand on shoulder. I just came up with some rubbish excuse. कि साढ़े चार पांच बजे मेरा चेकआउट टाइम है इसलिए वी नीड टू चेकआउट मेरी फ्लाइट है आई डेंट टेल हर कि मेरी फ्लाइट वो दिन रात को थी आई डोंट नो हाउ द होटल इन द फर्स्ट प्लेस एज लेट मी स्टे फॉर सो लॉन्ग बट दे डेड थैंक यू होटल बट आई टोल द नेम मेरी फ्लाइट अभी आई नीड टू लीव एंड एवरीथिंग सो आई जस्ट क्विकली पैक अप तो मेरी बैग भी पैक नहीं थी आई डोंट नो व्हाई सो आई जस्ट क्विकली पैक माय बैग एंड आई टोल्ड आई हैव टू लीव यू नो इट्स फाइन इफ यू लीव आई बुक फॉर अ कैब आल्सो आई वाज लाइक टू गेट दिस गर्ल आउट ऑफ माय होटल रूम प्लीज Bro, this girl is making the worst excuses on top of this. She was saying that my internet's not working. I said, okay, I'll give you my hotspot. She said, no, my phone doesn't accept hotspot. I was like, bro, what the hell are you lying for? Bro, I don't need that hotspot. <laughs> But yeah, I booked her a cab in the end, and obviously ultimately I didn't leave. But yeah, that was the time that this female creator kind of wanted to hook up with me. In fact, I've done the story time because you guys are like friends to me. Please don't go hunting for this creator's name. Do not start drama. I have not mentioned her name anywhere. 
Please. All right, guys. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this story time, tell me in the comments. I have a shit load of more stories that have happened in my life that I want to share with you guys. I have exposed myself a lot in this video. I will see you next time. Okay, chalo. Bye. Ha ha, nice joke. Ha ha ha.